Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you about offshoot encephalitis imaging. So offshoot encephalitis is an acute brain inflammation caused by infectious agent, most commonly virus, and sometimes it caused by non-infectious autoimmune brain inflammation. Presentation. Most common signs and symptoms vary widely, slightly meningeal to severe encephalic symptoms, plus minus fever, prodrome, varic cell, and epististor, soster. Different clinical manifestation of infection by same virus. Varic, varic cell encephalitis. Present with fever, headache, vomiting, seizure, other mental status, day to weeks after onset of chicken pox or rice. Soster, immune competent patient with cranial nerve and peripheral nerve palsy in dermatome involved by skin lesion. Seen CNB, ophthalmic brain is most affected. Rare complication, contralateral hemiplegia related to cerebral angiitis and myocardial aneurysm. Soster immune compressed prison with fever, meaning Gismus other mental status. Cerebralitis, sudden onset of limb and oil gate, ataxia after infectious prodrome. EV71, hand, put my disease, fever, basic on hand, feet, elbow, knee, lip, hepan, China, also of palate and foreign, cranial neuropathy, ocular disturbance, smear, tachycardia, if brainstem is involved. Nipah virus, fever, headache, dizziness, vomiting, symptom, no clonus, a reflexia, hypotonia, hypertension, tachycardia, OBE, fever, headache, confusion, tremor, may progress to paralysis, coma, respiratory failure, rabi, fever, malaise, and other mental state, limbic dysfunction, autonomic stimulation, paralytic, pubic of all extremity. Rhombencephalitis, a reflexia, ataxia, abdomo, Plague here, other signs and symptoms. CSF study are often abnormal. Demography. Age, occur at old age, sex, no sex predominant. Epidemiology, happens, most common cause of sporadic Viral encephalitis, Japanese encephalitis, most common endemic encephalitis in Asia. CNS involved in EBV is uncommon, 10, less than 10% of cases. Varicella virus, less than 1% have CNS involvement. Mark seasonal variation in US. Imaging, most viral encephalitis have wide-ranging, non-specific imaging finding poorly defined by mirror signal abnormality, bilateral cis symmetric basal pancreas and or thalamic signs, signal abnormality, minimal leptomeningeal enhancement, focus, plenum, signal abnormality, influenza and other viral encephalitis. Systemic 
symmetric and basal ganglionic growth of shoot necrotizing and circulitis of childhood. Abnormal gradual lobe enhancement, neuritis, COVID-19. This is non contraction hand CT in the 13 they are disseminated herpes simplex virus. So the hemorrhage lesion in the occipital lobe, perinatal HSV infection is typical from HSV2 acquired during passage through an infected birth canal. Older infant and child are more likely to have HSV1 infection. Again, this is a non contraction NCT in a six years old with West near virus encephalitis, so diffuse advancement of Sarkai with preservation of gray vimara differentiation. Peripheral sarkai should be visible over the convexity and any age they are absent indicated some degree of diffuse cerebral swelling. T1C plus FSMR in the nine years old with left sided weakness, so a right cerebral lesion, cortical enhancement, and hemorrhage necro uh, necrosis due to COVID 19 associated vasculitis and infarction. DWIMR in the 12 years old with seizures, so abnormal signal and swelling of right and Sula cortex due to GAG65 autoimmune encephalitis. GAD65 antibody is biomarker of CNS and non neurological autoimmune disease. T1C plus FSMR in a teenager presenting with nausea, headache, fever, and somalin, so abnormal leptomeningeal enhancement in the frontal and parietal sarcai. Serology was positive of West Nile virus. Treatment. It's the canon etiology. Thank you.